Hello again, friends. So I'm going to make another video for you guys explaining this activity, okay? So this is for Thursday, but I decided to show you ahead of time so you guys would know what to do when you got here. So this is our project for Thursday. Um, this is our activity that we're doing in the morning, okay? So you guys know how to do this. You're just going to fill in the missing letters on your own in these blank flowers. But on this worksheet, we have to draw the number of flowers that match each number. Okay, so we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, so we're going to have to draw that many flowers inside these vases. And I know it's gonna be hard because they're small, but you're gonna have to work on your fine motor skills and concentrate, okay? So we're gonna start with our first one, five, okay? And I'm only gonna do two of them. I'll do five and I'll do 10, just so you guys understand how to do it, okay? So I have to draw five flowers. So I'm gonna draw five stems first. One, two, three, four, five. And how I did that, look, I just drew five green stems. That way I can go back and I can add my flowers in once I know that I have five stems, okay? So I drew five stems because I have the number five in this vase, okay? So next, I'm gonna close my green and I'm going to make some purple flowers. Okay, and they don't have to be all extravagant, right? You can just make easy flowers. Okay, so I draw the middle, and I just draw those swoops on each one. Okay, if you want to put more detail into it, go ahead. But I am not much of a drawler. So I'm just going to keep it nice and simple for you guys. Okay, so look, my friends, I have the number five. So I drew one, two, three, four, five flowers. And also what I wanted to tell you guys is that I did some short and I did some tall. If you do it like that, you can fit more inside, okay? If you just draw five sticks all at the same level, you're not gonna be able to fit all of them. So you're gonna have to draw some tall sticks and some short sticks, okay? So let's do number 10. So we're gonna jump down here, but you guys are gonna do number six, draw six flowers, do number seven, draw seven flowers, eight, eight flowers, nine, nine flowers, and then I'll do number 10 with you guys to show you how to fit 10 in there, okay? So I'm gonna get my green again, and I'm gonna count and just do the stems. So I'm gonna do five tall. Two, three, four, five tall. And then I'm gonna do five short. So one, two, three, four. And this guy can come out there. So there are my five, I mean my 10 stems, so we can count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So now that I have my stems, switch my color and I'm going to do purple and pink flowers. So start with my shorts and add my little flowers. Now it'll probably be easier to use a marker. Sorry friends. Um, because it's a smaller area. If you guys use crayon, it might take up too much room, but it's up to you guys. You can also use your colored pencils because I gave you some. So there are my five short flowers. Now I'm gonna go do my five tall flowers because we know that five and five equal 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
okay? So let me go ahead and add my five purple flowers, which I made tall. Mm -hmm. Three, four, running out of room. So remember guys, you have to make them small or they're not going to fit. So we have my five up here and then we have our 10 down here. So look friends, they fit. You just gotta make them nice and tiny so they do, okay? They all have to come out of this vase depending on each number, okay? So I want you guys to do this whole paper. When we're done, when you're done, you can send me a picture. You could take a video of you doing it or you guys can come on our Google Meet on Thursday and we can do it together again, okay? So I will see you guys um, Thursday, and you have a great day, and enjoy your activity. Bye, friends.